There are 25 trays on a table in the cafeteria. Each tray contains a cup only, a plate only, or both a cup and a plate. If 15 of the trays contain cups and 21 of the trays contain plates, how many contain both a cup and a plate? Well, X represents the number of trays that contain only cups. Z, only plates. War, plates, and cups. It told us 15 of the trays contain cups. The trays that contain cups only contain cups, and the trays that contain cups and plates also contain cups. If I add up those two sections, it must be 15. The same logic tells you Z plus Y is equal to 21. But it also told us there were 25 trays all together. And what they want to know is how many contain both a cup and a plate. Well, that's the same thing as asking Y is equal to what. We can take x plus y is equal to 15 and substitute it where we see x plus y. So z is equal to 10. But then we can substitute the 10 into z plus y is equal to 21. And you can figure out that y is equal to 11. So if there's 25 trays that have only plates or cups, if there's 15 that have cups, and there must be 10 that have plates only. Once you realize that there's 10 that are plates only, but there's 21 that have plates, then there must be 11 that have plates and cups. But you don't even need to think about that complicated shit if you just know how to work with your equations.